Hey everyone, it's Heather, day four of the Beachbody Ultimate Reset. And before I get going and talk about how things are going so far, some people on my team wanted to see me take the Alkalinize supplement. Um, it's this. Yes, it looks so appealing. Um, it's just, it's like a green, it's pretty much a bunch of different types of grasses. Um, it's a little powder that you mix in with a couple ounces of water. It's gross, but I know people are hearing horror stories, but it's really not that bad. I mean... I don't think it's that bad, so suck it up. So, bottoms up. <sighs> okay. Whew. I mean, it does have a little bit of an aftertaste, but seriously, it's really not that bad. Okay, so on to how things are going. You know, I'm actually shocked I'm doing as well as I am. Um, I had did never hit that wall yet. I mean, I'm saying yet because it is only day four, but I, I never hit the wall that some people have experienced where they're extremely tired or need to nap or they just feel like they're really crashing hard. I feel really good. I have a lot more energy than normal now too, which I'm kind of shocked about because I'm nowhere near the amount of calories that I usually consume in a day. I know I'm not working out like I was either, so that probably plays a big part, but I'm finding myself getting up earlier in the morning, too. Usually my son will wake up to um, eat at about 6 o'clock, 6.30, and I used to go back to sleep. Now I'm, like, up and ready to go, so I, I'm, I'm assuming that's a good thing, you know? I, I would say so, but that's going really well. Um, so far, I've lost three pounds, which I'm already at my ideal weight, so... Um, I really am not looking to lose very much, if anything. Uh, my husband is down about three and a half to four pounds, I think is what he told me today. So that's great. You know, it, that means it's working. It's starting to clean us out. You know, I'm drinking a ton of water. Um, I'm used to drinking a lot of water, but I'm drinking even more now. So I'm constantly going to the bathroom even more. Um, but that's okay. You know, that's that's the whole point. The meals so far have been fantastic. The only thing I have not liked was the Japanese cucumber salad that we had last night for dinner. I, I don't know what was in it, but I didn't like the taste of it. So I think that's the only time we have it. But obviously there's going to be things on the menu that you may not like or that you're allergic to, but you can always swap it out for a different meal in the same phase, which is nice. But um, one other thing is there is a lot of prep work. I'm not going to lie about that. It is a ton of prepping, and it's mainly washing and cutting up vegetables and stuff. So like salads, I'm recommending people prepare them on the weekends or whatever that day is that you've got free time. Prep up all those salads, and then when you need them for that day, that way they're ready to go, and all you have to do is grab out which dressing because you can pre-make a bunch of, like I think there's three or four dressings in there that you can pre-make. So I would recommend doing that. Um, and same with like the rice and kiona and stuff, you can pre-make that and then just, you know, put it in a airtight container and heat it up, um, whenever you need it. Same with the soup or anything like that. So, um, usually what I do is I'll prep mine a day or two before, a few days before, especially cause I have to get my husband's stuff ready for lunch for the next day. And then I end up just making mine as well. So it's been great. My willpower, I, I'm so proud of myself. Usually I just... I just indulge. I just want to eat everything. Um, I've done really well. It's it's hard because, you know, when my kids, I'm giving them like a graham cracker or something, I just want to lick it. I know that's crazy, but like my mouth starts watering and I really want it, but I'm doing well. So that means it's working. And also my taste buds must be changing. I am not the biggest fan of the vegan tropical shakeology and it's because I'm a texture person. Um, it's a little gritty because of the brown rice protein. Well, you're only allowed the vegan Shakeology during the reset, obviously, because it's vegan. Um, and I had one for a snack yesterday. I used a half scoop with water and um, a couple frozen strawberries and a clementine. And it was amazing. I mean, it was so good. It was really refreshing. It just it hit that spot. It was great. Um, as far as exercise, no, I am not doing Insanity or Les Mills Pump or anything like that. I'm sticking to what the guide says and just doing yoga. I've done a little bit of ab work and I've been taking my kids for walks in the wagon. So I'm getting out, enjoying the fresh air. I'm really starting to miss my workouts though. It's kind of sad. I do miss the Les Mills pump already. I keep looking at the calendar and I'm like, I should be here right now. But, you know, I'm doing this for a reason. I, I want to get my um, food in check and 
really want to focus on clean eating and stop waking up every morning saying today's a new day and then at three or four o'clock in the afternoon I'm like hmm, okay let's open the pantry and eat graham crackers animal cookies Cheez-Its and everything else under the sun so I'm, I'm hoping this is helping it's still too early to see how things are going but so far I'm, I'm enjoying it I'm enjoying the cooking um, you know I've lost the three pounds it's been great so far. Um, I'm starting up a group May 16th um, for the Ultimate Reset. So if you are interested in doing this and you want to change your health, um, click the links below, get the Ultimate Reset. Uh, if you want to learn a little bit more about it, go to heatherfoltz.com, click on the Beachbody Ultimate Reset tab so you can get a little bit more information. You can also get the reset on my website as well. And connect with me, facebook.com slash heather.foltz. And we um, will get you set up with the group and get you started on the reset. You know, that way I will have completed it by then. So I'll be able to guide you through it. And I think I have about 10 to 12 people right now that are going to be doing it that day. So a good amount of people that you can connect with. So just let me know. And I look forward to hearing from you. And if you have any questions, comment below or again, connect with me. So have a great day and be sure to follow up on my blog. I've been blogging every day as well, heatherfoltz.com. So we will see you later. Bye.